guys, this is Julia, and this is the G major three octave scale, and I'm going to have my brother David join me again because I'm paying him a Hershey's bar to be in this video, and I'm going to get my full Hershey's bar word. So, we're going to start with some music theory questions again. Um, if you want to skip ahead, though, you can find the timestamp in the description below. So, first question. How many sharps or flats are in the key of G major? There's one sharp in the key of G major. And what is that sharp? It's F sharp. Good. And what would be the relative minor of G major? It would be E, mi e minor. <laughs> Sorry, what was that? It would be E minor. <laughs> Thank you, David. And for the key of G major, would I start on an open string G, or would I start with a 2 on G? You could start on an open string G. Good. So now I'm going to play it through once, and I'm going to stop when I get to the ships. David is just here for moral support this time. So starting with G, can you guys see my fingers? Yeah? yeah. Okay. So I'm going to start with G, and then I'll tell you when we get to the first ship. Start in first position. Here's your first shift to third position. Shift again to another one. This is three, four, four. Now on the way down, we're going to start with four, three, two, one. Shift to a four, and now you're going to go the rest of the scale down just in first position. Okay, and we're going to do this one more time with a metronome. So if you need to follow along with the fingerings, there will be a link below so that that way you can look at those while I play. David's going to help me with the metronome. This is 60 beats per minute. Ready, set, go. Thank you, David. Okay, and if you notice that time, I played, instead of playing fours on my way up, I played open strings. So I think that, like personally, I think that that can go either way, but if Mr. V has a preference, I'm sure he'll clarify that for you. And so we're gonna do that again, this time a little slower. So if it was too fast for you the first time, don't worry. I got you covered this next time. No, just the same tempo, but I'll play. Okay. So yeah, same tempo, but I'm just gonna play it for um, one note for two beats. Ready, set, go.
Okay, so thank you guys for watching this video. I hope it helped you. Um, good luck. And now, for anybody who stuck around after that, David has got a message for our subscribers. Wow. <laughs>